Hello everyone and welcome to this new video. Today we're going to prepare our lineup. This time, yes, we will do it. Uh, but first things first, uh, well, uh, it's very early in the morning right now, so hopefully by the time you'll see this video, you'll watch this video, uh, we'll have good news about uh, Ericsson. We've had a few good news yesterday evening. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to have uh, even better news today. So, uh, that said, uh, let's try and see what we can do with um, with today's lineup. So, first things first, we'll have to uh, have a look at who our next opponents will be. And they will be Castagna. Castagna sits here in the league. They have conceded three goals so far in two matches. And they have scored twice. Uh, getting a total of one point. So let's have a look at what they, uh, what that team looks like, and let's try and figure out what we can do against them. So uh, there we go. Forty-five point four with four stars for uh, for the goalkeeper. Then the right back four stars. Eighteen point four. Uh, that one guy sounds counterable at least. 18.7 with 4 stars, 4 stars 27.4, 4 stars, uh, four stars 37.2 or so, we have to expect um, these guys to cap themselves basically and not go way higher with their routine. Then we have, uh, wow, f uh, 4.5 stars with 45.3. Then we have 37.6 with 4 stars, dangerous, 37 with 4.5 stars, uh, 27.6 with 4 stars, and he'll receive the boost, quite a good one actually, so 15.5 uh, with 4.5 stars, and 30.7 with 4.5 stars, now this one guy will receive the boost up to max 27.6 which is already high for a four and a half stars player uh, so this time let's have a look at what the score was 1-1 one, one, of course the opponents have the, an apparently good defense at the center well not impressively good but they were very thick at the center, so they will, were probably able to counter these four guys uh, somehow. And they had two strikers, so they were able to score. It's not going to be easy for us, though. Uh, and we have a somewhat... Well, we used to have a somewhat weak defense. Now we're going to give it a boost. Thanks to Townsend. And we'll replace Fishnaller who was put on the transfer list uh, well actually I did not expect Townsend to go down to four stars as a defender of course it's not the best role he can play in but I was expecting him to stay at four and a half stars we might probably want to exploit him as a defensive midfielder uh, but the can Charlie small weak with the with heading skills. Still he's very good with marking, tackling and positioning so and with the work rate as well. So this might not actually be a bad option. Let's have a look at what kind of impact he could have on the team. Well things would basically stay the same. This guy, this Olivieri guy will have his boost up to 24.2 which is not extremely high but it might be sufficient then Townsend will be able to help out the defence um, should we probably play with Shorey and Townsend together hmm interesting very interesting to counter the opponent's offensive midfield, the 
which is very thick and very good and then Vario Pinto would have the freedom around here to play since the opponents don't really have a thick midfield as you can see there's a lot of space but I think uh, we might want to exploit this space a little bit more mm, we play normal with throw balls normal balanced by the opponents which I think is the best way to play against them but what about the speed of our defenders it's not massive is it it's definitely not massive it's not bad either in my opinion so we might try and Venier and Zanotti of course are going to help with speed and skills and so on so we m so we could probably oh central midfielder actually is a central midfielder either a central midfielder oh yeah he was probably modified so either central midfielder or fullback hmm I don't like him very much in this role though he's very good at defending should be a defensive midfielder No. Hmm. But he's too slow for throw balls, is he not? Whilst Shorey sounds like looks like he's very good at it. And he's got lower finishing skills than Townsend. Yes, let's do it like this. Um so we might be able to defend against those opponents and ho hopefully Shori will suffice to help out the defense defending uh, and countering the opponent on top of that we'll have very uh, two very good uh, central midfielders here exploiting the space around here so let's do it so this is the way we want to play on top of that Magari will have an experience boost I believe up to well in theory up to around 30 but the problem is that login will be capping him at 26.2 so what we want to do is having a look here and this guy has got somewhat low routine this guy has higher routine so we want to play on the left we'll be playing on the wings or short passing hmm probably on the wings no sorry I clicked on the wrong button yes there we go no not yet just a second all right there we go so uh, this is fine passer de crescenzo bolzi quelli con i piscitelli is fine so the bench is all there let's first set up the the subs so quelli con i will replace Mazzotta here no probably Cancialli Cancelli will be replaced by Quiricorni. And there we go as a central defender. That's it. And then um, we'll go normal. Let's try and exploit the space where uh, left on the midfield, in the midfield, and then playing on the wings on the left. And that is it, guys yes I think that is it we might probably want to go slightly defensive against that kind of opponent but I'm afraid we wouldn't be able to exploit the uh, the midfield enough well, at the same time I'm saying to myself that this guy hasn't got 
enough routine, does he? Uh, whilst this one guy has massive routine, so no wonder Castagna had a, had a bit of a struggle while trying to score. Uh, now let's go slightly defensive. This might help us out a tiny bit with defending against those players. Uh, but we s should still be able to retain a decent amount of ball possession around here with these one, two, three, four, five guys. Uh, and hopefully, Yossa will be able to pierce through that somewhat low routine defense. So, guys, uh, I think that is it for today's video. Uh, again, hopefully, we'll have some good news about, um, about Ericsson. And, yeah. See you in the next video. Bye.